All right, guys. Um, I got something a little bit different. A fire piston. And it comes from campfirepiston.com. Um, you get a bag of char cloth. You get an two o-rings and then you get the fire piston itself it's like twenty four dollars it's actually not too bad and what we are going to try here is we're going to get some char cloth out Oh, fuck. And I just grabbed a little bit. What you do is push it down into the divot on the rod end of the piston. So it sits in there like that. And the mechanics of this is actually pretty simple. It goes in. Can you see this? Yeah. Come out, there's your coal. And that coal dumps into your tender. And then you can blow it into flame. Oh, let's see. This is wet, so it probably ain't gonna work. Hold that tie. Normally, you would be a lot faster. Trying to get it out, but Is there anything in that? Let me check. Yeah, there's still a little bit of short cloth in that. Anyhow, this straw is pretty wet. It's been out in the rain and shit. But that's really all there is to it. Did you get me trying to light that? Yeah. It's just that easy. And once you get your coal, it's on. I don't know. You can see that little divot in there. That's where I put the uh, char cloth. But uh, I don't know. I think it'll be pretty fun. I think it'll be really fun for the kids. And uh, to me, it's a backup for the one thing that I think is maybe one of the most important parts of survival all right guys thanks for watching and uh catch you on the next one